Welcome to Now We Are Talking TV, I'm Peter Habib. Today we're going to be speaking to two Telstra ambassadors, Beijing Olympians Stephanie Rice and Sophie Eddington. We'll find out from them what it was like to be in Beijing, but more importantly, what it meant for them to receive Telstra hero messages. Sophie, what was it like to be amongst the Olympic atmosphere? Yeah, it was fantastic. It was a great atmosphere and, and Beijing put on a fantastic show. It, it all ran very smoothly and it, and it was just really exciting to be there. Yeah, the same thing. I mean, it was my first Olympics, so I was going to be excited no matter where it was. But Beijing put on an amazing, amazing show and I think it'll definitely be one that I'll remember for a long time. It's hard being away from home, but Telstra has the Telstra hero message. What did that mean to receive hero messages from back here in Australia? It was amazing to get the um, Australian support and I think when we were in Beijing we didn't really know you know, what was going on back in Australia so it was a great way just to check and, um, and get um, a bit of um, support from back home. Yeah, it was really cute getting, getting all the messages and you know, I loved the ones that were, hi Sophie, I'm Sophie too and you know, it was just really cute and, and all the family, friends and things that haven't been in contact with for, for a while, it was really nice to hear from them and, and know that they're supporting you back home. And would you say that that would be your favourite message, just the, the, the ones from, from left field? Yeah, absolutely. Like the, the ones that you don't expect, um, you know, are obviously the best. You know, people you don't know, are always it's always fantastic to get them and it's, it's great support. But when you get one from people you know, you're like, oh my goodness, you know, like they're thinking of me and, you know, they're watching. So, yeah, it's, it's really cool. And Stephanie, what was your favourite hero message? I don't know if I could narrow it down to a favourite. I mean, I just really loved all the ones from the little kids in primary school and kindergarten and they do, you know, they just write things that you would never think of, you know, even saying to someone. So they're so cute and um, it was really, like, refreshing to read. Well, you're both Telstra ambassadors, which is a, a, a privileged uh, a thing to be part of. Um, but I guess the question remains, three gold medals in this Olympics, a, a silver medal for yourself, where to from now? Um, definitely a break um, is on its way and I'm very enjoying it at the moment but um, I'm definitely shooting for 2012. Um, it's a huge goal of mine so I'm just kind of trying to work my way back up there again. Yeah for me you know it's just taking it one year at a time and enjoying the experience and hopefully getting a bit of travel and, and some more racing. And you've got some swimming coming up in, in just the end of the month. Yeah, yeah, I'll we'll be competing down in Melbourne um, at the National Short Course Championships. So, yeah, it should be interesting. <laughs> well, Stephanie and Sophie, thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Thank you.